You crazy bastards. You actually did it. You pulled the plug on Adobe Flash, aka Macromedia Player, aka Shockwave Flash, aka Flash. He was on life support for years, I suppose. Flash was with us for real for about 25 years or so. But I do want to remind everyone that Flash was not all fun and games, even though that's mainly what it was used for and why people remember it fondly. It's time that we remember that Flash was a source of major vulnerabilities in hacking events every single year. By the way, most of the time, Linux won and Apple performed the worst in those events. Just, you know, throwing that out there. Flash was a bastion of exploits for hackers, crackers, and any other type of security-minded people that like to make money off of your system being weak. And we can only wonder how much telemetry data and military tech has been stolen because a bored military tech, uh, someone at one of the military weapons manufacturers, soldiers, sailors, or flyboys just got bored at work and decided to play a couple video games thinking it was no big deal. I will say though, one of my fondest memories of Adobe Flash was in 2012 when Apple discontinued its functionality in iOS where people like me, Android users, were able to laugh at iOS people because they couldn't play YouTube videos for like a week until YouTube upgraded their system to tap into that big old podcast market that was just beginning to evolve. For all of you nostalgia gamers who love those Flash games though, there is some light at the end of this tunnel for you. With the death of Flash comes a whole host of internet gaming archive websites Blue Maxima is up here for Flashpoint, so if there's a game that you miss, remember, it will still be there. You will be able to have a good time. As for the rest of us, if we need access to Flash for, say, a business productivity application, and trust me, there are ones out there from experience, you will be able to access Flash still. You're just going to have to install a outdated browser and if you guys remember the LimeWire days, it's going to be open season on your computer when you install those. So VMs only need apply so it doesn't infect the rest of your system. I will say in closing that the last two and a half years of my life have been dedicated to replacing this piece of software, this Swiss cheese program for viruses and malware and system access. And I will credit Flash for one thing. It did just work. And the fact that it just worked bought my team and I just enough time to replace it with something equally solid. So now with the new year, I will bid all of you a happy and blessed 2021. Flash may be gone all things do come to an end. Nick, signing out.